Okay, I heard enough there. I can already smell the cherry tomatoes coming from your breath. And if we're going to be honest here, you probably bathe in olive oil and use Italian dressing for perfume. Okay, what's up, boys? Welcome back to another video on the horrible channel. Well, a few things changed before this video is uploaded. I changed my banner. Completely honest, I thought it was, uh... Dogs. <laughs> so I made a new one, and personally, I think it's pretty cool, but I know there's going to be comments saying... My disappointment is immeasurable. <laughs> that was ruined. Yes, there's anime in my banner, and yes, it is the sexiest banner that was ever made in history. <laughs> the changes don't end there. I also think I solved world hunger, because that's right, I made a Twitter account. So if you guys would follow me on Twitter and retweet a screenshot of you following me... I'll give you a shout out. <laughs> that's right, guys. If you want free clout, follow me on Twitter. Okay, enough of me blabbering. Vegan. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the fuck? Okay, I don't really care if people are vegans at all. Or vegetarian. Whatever the pronounce. <laughs> you know, if you want to eat the grass out of your backyard like a bunny, that's perfectly okay in my book. It's the vegans who hate people who hate meat that I just like. Like, I'm sorry, I'll pass using a rice cake as a burger patty. This video comes from the channel Facts. I, I really wish I'm joking. That's literally the name. It's the word facts. So let's watch a bunch of gypsies induce cholesterol into their organs. I'm gonna be tasting meat for the first time in about 30 years. I think it's also been 30 years since you walked outside because you're kind of acting like Dracula suntanning on a Miami beach. I really can't talk, boys. The only time I leave the house is to go to school and then I sit in my dungeon for eight hours a day. Honestly, I think I'm immune to claustrophobia at this point. Yes. I've been a vegetarian for about a year now. Oh wow guys, she's a vegetarian pro. She hasn't eaten meat in a year. So it must be absolutely just disgusting to even gaze at a steak. Well boys, I had a Big Mac last week and I am vegan. So looking at any piece of meat makes my stomach start playing a game of Twister. So I'm really just completely turned off meat. So I'm really nervous. <laughs> Coming up to five years, I would be vegetarian now I'd say. I fell off the wagon once or twice at the start. Cause it's not easy. And what's the point of becoming one? People act like cows and pigs are like a celestial knowledge and obtain more memory than Stephen it. Hawking with Albert Einstein as a conjoined twin. And that's why they won't be able to kill animals. Like, no, they literally are just mindless creatures that have nothing to do with their lives. Okay, I have no disrespect towards vegetarians at all, you know? Choose your diet how you want to choose it. Just don't discriminate people who want to eat meat, you know? But yeah, good five years. I'm proud to say. Well, that ends today. How do these people claim to be vegetarian, but they're literally about to eat meat? How does that make any sense? Oh yeah, guys, I'm literally vegetarian. I carry a barf bag every time I see meat. Oh, you want me to eat meat for views? Sure, I definitely could. Through being a vegetarian. I wonder if they told everyone in the video it's all made of tofu. <laughs> <laughs> that that would've been funny. Oh my god! It's sausage with- is that bacon around it, is it? Because I've only ever had a barbecued vegetables <laughs> yeah just throw a whole head of lettuce on top of it i'm sure it'll be nice and dandy wouldn't it barbara it's not as good as i remembered i'm sorry i just couldn't imagine swallowing it oh you did 30 years ago so it's not that hard to imagine honestly the more i look at you the more you start to turn into a member of the adams family Okay, if they notice steak, then my hope in humanity is just lost. Psych! Okay, I feel like I have to say I'm joking because there's probably a vegetarian watching this, and I want to let you know I love you. No homo. You choose what you want to eat. <gasps> no, God, no. <laughs> Gosh, even cutting this is hard. It's the one thing you never have to worry about with vegetables. Wait a minute! <clears throat> Onions. Oh, that just made me reconsider my whole entire diet right there because the steak is so hard to cut. I'm only eating the radishes that grows out of my backyard now. I knew there was going to be meat involved, but you know what? I didn't even, I wasn't even going to allow myself to think what kind of meat. Jesus, how do people do this? <laughs> yeah, but a year ago you would have been like, Oh, yum. Yeah. You only been a vegetarian for a year. Don't act like it's disgusting because we all know in your mind you like it. Don't they know I'm busy spoiling myself? Oh, <laughs> Is that enough of a taste? <laughs> okay, do it. <laughs> it just doesn't seem like food. So dipping the chicken in the blue cheese, is that cheating? 
Okay, I'm going to shock everyone here. I d absolutely despise blue cheese. If you just think about the process that makes blue cheese, it's just disgusting, you know? Who wants old, rotten, moldy cheese? Well, apparently every drunk dad on a Sunday night at Buffalo Wild Wings does. Something I just never really liked since like the day I was born. Okay, no, that's as good as I remember. Strangely, out of all the meats, chicken is the one that I really can't stand. Even the thought of. Even just the, the fact you have to touch it with your fingers. It's okay, it's not gonna become alive and fly away. This woman is acting like she's picking up a human brain. Like, it's literally just a chicken wing. It's not gonna give you Ebola. I mean, it might give you cool eyes, though. So there's that thought for you. Just when I took a bite into it and I touched the bone, I just... I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, that happened. It's definitely the worst so far. <laughs> Why is the I'm bun good. eight times bigger than that disgusting barnacle looking patty? Can't blame them if they hate to eat this one. I would hate to eat this burger as well. That thing just looks like I was somehow contracting STD from it. This is cow. This should be easy because, well, easier, I think, because it's more processed. I can really just taste the meat, like, compared to everything else, but I can really <laughs> just need to spare. Little McDonald had a farm. <laughs> you know while you're cutting that burger probably a couple thousand cows got slaughtered right like it's okay cutting a dead cow is better than witnessing a thousand get pressed down to a beefcake what surprised me is that most disgusting looking thing they showed is the most least complained about thing by the vegetarians like that burger looks like a shriveled up raisin <laughs> I can feel the knife cut into it I'm like oh yeah this is my memory of me that you're just chewing and chewing and it's not going anywhere and call me crazy but i never heard of a veal like what 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 actually is a veal well considering it looks like just a really burnt pierogi i really don't want to know veal yeah why is that honestly with veal it's kind of the ethical thing that's why people don't eat it but in terms of tasting i can't imagine it's any different Ugh. my stomach's turning just even like thinking about biting into it <laughs> i feel so guilty because that's nice the texture was much better than the steak because it's a baby i heard of the meat sweats but i never heard of the meat tears listen it's sad that a turkey would ever die but it's still great tasting right so you really can't complain about it just i don't look at it as being food anymore like i really just look at it as being a flesh of an animal like i'm a lot more set yeah a lot more assertive now and i'm sure that i'm I'm, I'm vegetarian for life. Well, um, that, that's, that's a lie. Because you just ate meat, so you kind of played yourself right there, didn't you? Well, boys, time to wrap this video up in some nice crispy bacon. Alright, well, if you guys enjoy, make sure to drop a like and tell me how you feel. Did the girl of your dreams just, just dump you? Comment that down below. I love to interact with you guys. Follow my Twitter link will be down below in the description. And I hope you all have a great day. I'm gonna head out and buy me a Big Mac.